now we're back. Look at the dragon tongue beans are flowering. We're gonna have beans soon. The rose bush has left over. I harvest the broccoli, but there's more broccoli shoots coming out. It's the kind that grows the stalk, not the head. I thought my cabbage were dead because the bugs were eating the outer leaves, but it looks like they may have bounced back. And in between there, I put in a cantaloupe. And then these are some chives I have to plant. And then I have a volunteer Chinese cabbage. I'm happy. Then we come over here. I think that's a red crimson melon. Right here is the yellow baby doll melon and a cantaloupe. Then we have strawberry towers. I've been picking strawberries off. They're flowering. And then they're growing nicely. See the strawberries coming out. And the runners are going crazy. And those are petunias. But in between the petunias, I planted two jicamas. We'll see how they do. Then we come back around here. This was supposed to be an all bean patch, but the lima beans didn't come up for some reason this year. And it's another watermelon. Then I stuck some lemongrass and I have garbanzo beans growing so I can make my own hummus. I love hummus. And so out of those, they look like they all sprouted. So I should be able to get some chickpeas. Then more potatoes. Then we come here the five-in-one pear tree. This is the regular pear tree to keep a pear. Then just some wild native plants. Then that's the five-in-one cherry tree. And right here was my dwarf mulberry. Oh, I had two, but one died in the cold. And this was just one little twig and look at it now. Wow, mother nature's awesome. Then in here, 100, gallon root pouch for sweet potatoes. This back half is Beauregard, and in the front is my um, slips I started for North Carolina purple stoke sweet potatoes. So I got purple and orange growing in here. Then come around here is the Celeste fig tree. I think that's the Bear's fig tree right here. And I don't know, there's little figs growing. You can see them. So come the end of summer, have figs. This is the loquat tree, which is so pretty. This is the little Miss Figgy. And I forgot which type of fig this is, but we come around to the other side. And then you can just see how beautiful the loquat tree is. It's gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. And then I'm going to take a break.